What's all my carcumaniacs out there? This is Calcobo, the Forger of Pain. And today I'm gonna talk about... Just give me one second. Uh, oh my god. Oh, the figures of on my back. Uh, Mario plus rabbits kingdom battle. Oh my god. Today I have two children of the night. Hi guys. I have Con and Ejo, and they're my little furry helpers. Okay, goodbye. Be free. Be free, my child. Or stay there. Before getting to the action figures, well, they're not really action figures, but I think we must talk a little history about the Raymond Raven Rabbits. If you never heard of Raymond Raven Rabbits, let me describe it to you. <clears throat> Imagine the minions. Ba 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 na na. Ba 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 na 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 na. Ba 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 na na. Now, imagine they are more annoying. Schizophrenic, psychotics, and not only that, but these rabbits, that's right, with a D, not a T, are in an overdosage of crack-inducing cocktail of caffeine, meth cocaine, and a little bit of LSD. Where did they came from? Well, it started as a spin-off game from the Raymond series. But explaining who Raymond is, well, that's a video for another day. Let's just say he was one of those platform mascots from the mid-90s who was trying to compete with Mario. And I just want to tell you a little secret. Raymond's games are not half bad. The game consists of a buttloads of mini games that are actually kind of fun to play with friends, I might add. actually recommend picking some of these games and you'll have a blast. This franchise is the very definition of a party game. It became so popular that we got game after game after game, especially on the Wii, which used the motion controls to its advantage. A pretty solid gameplay for the most part. Ubisoft had a great relationship with Nintendo. Most of their games were exclusive to the Nintendo Wii, like I mentioned earlier. And from this relationship, Mario Plus Kingdom Battle was born. Now, if you've never heard of this game before, let me tell you something. Nintendo went out of their comfort zone. And well, not actually Nintendo. Actually, this game was developed by Ubisoft. Partnership with Nintendo, of course, but this game is an RTS. When I first heard of this title at E3 2017, I wasn't sure what to think about. But then I did a double take and I was like, whoa! And guess what? It's an XCOM Nintendo game. I never thought that would happen. 
No, really, look at it. And I am a sucker for XCOM. An RTS game like this with Mario and rabbits. This? This just might work. And it did. And I wasn't the only one excited about it. Just look at the presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, Miyamoto-san. As you can see in the packaging, it's kind of all Amiibo-ish, but this is slightly bigger than the Amiibos in comparison. But um, I don't know why Nintendo didn't make these Amiibos. I don't know if maybe because it's Ubisoft, I don't know if it's the right, I have no idea why, but uh, the base looks like a Amiibo-ish, like I said before, but not really. details of the little statues does not disappoint once again, especially the weapons. If you look real close, the tiniest things are very well done, and a great paint job by the way. The honest truth is that the rabbits steal the freaking show in the game, and they all have their personalities, uh, Peach is with her cell phone doing her selfies, and she's kind of a millennial, if you will. And, but my favorite one, it has to be Yoshi Rabbit. He's all uh, uh, crazy with his big ass gun. And uh, yeah, really, it, it's really fun. They make the game the, uh... If you want to acquire these little guys, you'll have to order them at the Ubisoft store. I own the three inches figures that would cost around 20 bucks. But there are 6 inch versions at 40 smackaroos. And um, even 20 bucks is a little steep. So it's your call. As always, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Please leave in the comments like this game? Do you plan of getting this figures? Uh, oh, they're not Amiibos, which is weird by Nintendo, but anyway, I digress. As always, thank you guys, and this is Karakam Gaming. Like.